Welcome back to Persona 5 Royal. Don't even think you can eat that tree. You can't. <clears throat> so last time we met a handsome man voiced by Matthew Mercer. Um, which is just kind of how life goes. Uh, and I think today we're going to be, uh, we're going to be going to his art, art exhibit at a museum. Hey. Yes, uh, he invited on and only on, and I guess you two are coming too. Yeah, we're gonna You're fiddle thieves. around. You don't need invitations. Yeah, yeah, that's the, that's kind of the point. Oh. All right, let's head right to Briod. We also went to Mementos for the first time last time, which is where we deal with what I call minor douchebags. Yes, we also met Jose. Right. Flower, little flower boy. Well, we met him in the stream at before last, but he just broke our wall in our casino. <laughs> oopsie poopsie, best guess you better lock me up in the vault. Oh, you're gonna say oopsie poopsie, investigucci. <laughs> so crowded. <clears throat> Whoa, Morgana, you're summoning everybody <laughs> with your mentions of crowds. <laughs> so crowded. Must be more crowded. <laughs> you, so I used my right, passive. Right? You came. We um, saw. Yeah. <laughs> Goodbye, really and he walks away. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you expect when you left us those tickets? Make sure that you don't get in the way of the other visitors. Come now, I'll show you around. I'd like to speak more about the picture I'd like to draw, too. Well, see you guys later. Will Lady Han be all right? <laughs> what if he drags her behind some painting and tries something funny? Even worse, what if he tries something hilarious? <laughs> I told you not to come out. Or hysterical. Gonna what if he tries something unfunny? He'll be so embarrassed. <laughs> <laughs> what if he tries a card trick and messes it up? I guess we I like should it here. Do it once. Uh, <laughs> I don't want to go. Are we supposed to start? Maybe someone will paint me. And I don't mean make a painting of me. They'll just <laughs> color me. Old man from the other just day. take a paintbrush. <laughs> On my face. We continue yeah. to be truly surprised by your imagination. You have such expansive styles. It's hard to believe that it all stems from one person. Where in the world does all your inspiration come from? Well, it is rather difficult to put into words. They naturally well up from within my heart. I really thought for you you just gonna close the light up. Naturally, you say. What's important is to distance oneself from worldly desires. I'm gonna make a call right now. He he steals people's ideas and takes credit for them. He's speaking like somebody who would. My atelier is a modest. Yeah, yeah I think people like Yusuke, his uh, his proteges. He just takes their art. That's what I'm guessing. Yeah. And he has no actual talent of his own. So the act of emptying one's mind gives rise to inner beauty. I just eat the paint. Still, to think we could hear the word shack coming from the great artist Madarame. What kind of freaking lunatic says the word shack? You would understand if you saw it. <laughs> Basketball players. What's that the word shack? Something... Madarame-san is actually here? Sharp eye, sharp eyed customer. Over there. <laughs> I'm just gonna. I'm gonna hold on this scene for a minute. Over there, runs up, stops right where he is, <laughs> stares. I'm so glad I came on opening day. Holy shit! Okay, stop pushing. Christ, wave of babies. People. people, people, please line up. I may draw a circle. <gasps> oh my God. Anyways, we you ever seen that episode of SpongeBob? What if he was actually just a shit artist and he grabbed a pencil and just a crooked circle and complete and the crowd fucking goes wild? <laughs> you 
Usually one the Madarabi starts crowd style. surfing. However, since he creates all this by himself, he's special. I like that painting directly uh, behind him there, the colorful forest looking deal. Looks nice. There you are, Yusuke. Sensei. Ah, the girl from yesterday. Are you enjoying the exhibit? I don't know how to put it into words, but it's really amazing. You're sensing something from the artwork. That alone is enough to give us artists satisfaction. I hope this becomes a wonderful piece, Yusuke. Well then, if you'll excuse me. You'd imagine artists would be difficult to approach. This seems really friendly. Yeah, very, very nice. If only this interrogating lady from the future didn't say he was a douchebag. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> now this guy is a douchebag. Oh, <laughs> Tell me about it. The painting I wanted to see in person. Oh, on and I have this similar tastes, one? it seems. I guess it's the painter's anger? I'm not sure, but I sense this strong frustration from it. To think such a cheerful and gentlemanly person could make such a piece. It's almost like he made one mistake and Something he just kept wrong? making more out of anger. And then he Don't sold it. Me. Shit! 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 Come now, this way. I heard my throat. Hey! There's my mistake for the day. It was worth it for the la half, though. The la, the la half, indeed. Ah, that old lady totally elbowed me. Thanks to that, I remember now. Remember what? <laughs> I remember how to elbow people now. She taught me that well, move. Let me get to I'm gonna go Yoshi elbow. elbow. <laughs> I'm gonna go elbow a CEO now. It's about a post online. <laughs> You're so gonna elbow a seal. <laughs> Look at this. Caragur, Auntie Bob Ross teaches painting with anger and spite. <laughs> Here we're gonna put some pissed off little trees. You and we're gonna out. set them on fire! Into this huge crowd and... He's entirely hairless, too. <laughs> yeah. Like, he looks like the lead singer of Midnight Oil. <laughs> this post might be about Madarame. God damn it. Oh, no, not Otto. Um... Okay. What's it say? A master of the Japanese arts is plagiarizing his pupil's work. Only his public face is shown on TV. Plagiarizing? I didn't think much of it when I first saw it, but hearing Shaq and Madarame triggered it. What the fuck? Is, what's everyone's fixation on the word Shaq? I don't understand. His treatment of the pupils who live with him is well, awful. you know. He teaches nothing and bosses People them around. People want checks. He treats them inhumanely, as if disciplining a dog. Abuse on top of plagiarism, hmm? Huh? If this is real, it'll be a huge scandal. Don't say that with such a giant smile, Ryuji. <laughs> I wonder if Kitaga Akun posted this. Huh, this could go horribly wrong. I mean, he is a pupil of his. Who knows? Anonymous and all. In that case, it's possible the Madarame we heard about in Mementos is referring to the same one. A man like that doing such a thing? I wonder if we can ask that shadow from earlier about this. Oh, actually, we just need to talk to him in reality. Let's How go stalk the stalker. Are we gonna explain it all, starting with Mementos? Besides, if we make a move out in the open, there's the possibility that Madarame will find out. Oh. Yeah. Right. Hey, what do you think about Madarame? Doesn't he seem suspicious? Um, it might be fake. Let's start doubting things. But yes, he does seem suspicious. I know, right? This all fits way too well to just be a coincidence. If this post is legit, ain't this the kind of target we've been waiting for? Well, yeah, but... Yeah, taking out really somebody true? everybody knows. By the way, 
What did you do about the whole modeling thing? Kitago Akun gave me his contact info and the address to his sensei's atelier. Today I learned how to pronounce that word. I know they said it earlier, and I wanted to say that when they said it earlier, but I didn't. He said he lives there, right? Perfect timing. Let's try going tomorrow. We're off to Matarame's house right after school. Huh? You want me to model tomorrow? This is too sudden. What? We're just gonna go talk to Kitagawa. Oh, that's what you meant. Okay. All right, things are heating up. I feel like we're officially starting to enter like what I what I'd consider like the second chapter. Well then. Oh, thanks for reminding me, Morgana. You say you pay very close attention to TV, and it slightly worries me. <laughs> I don't pay attention to anything else. All right, let's see. Allergy relief pack. Two masks. Well, that's useful. Twenty white eye drops. Cosmetic cure gift. An aroma machine and an omni vitamin. I mean, I feel like I need. Oh, this is a limited item. Yeah, Sunday deals are usually uh, one-time purchases. Oh, okay. I thought they were bringing up a third thing. Nah, they always make you choose between uh, two different options. It's a callback to the shopping network from uh, Persona 3 and 4. 14,000 yen? Jesus. Oh, yeah, also the gift things, the gift items are things you can't use. Like, they're to be given to other players, uh, characters. Oh, so it's for... Oh, it's for... <laughs> It's for, like, relationship shit. Yeah, uh, or in this case, uh, confidant stuff. What's the confusion and dizziness? They're to be given to other players. They're to be given to Yoshi. G give it to me, Jake. <laughs> I'm really having as, trouble with this one boss, and I think... As I your persona it. sensei, I can use more as health. As your Madarame. <laughs> as I'm profiting off of your hard work. I mean, I don't really want either of these, frankly. Yeah, you don't have to get any of them. If you don't yeah. Want. Like sometimes there'll be like a really neat thing that you should spring for, but for the most part, it, it just comes down to how you play. So. Yeah. Yeah. Including me. Watch your back, bud. <laughs> Push. Come on. Now listen up. Show me what's up. What do you want to do? I mean. Morgana won't let me leave. He'll kill me if I do. Uh, so I may as well just... Uh, I study? Well, I mean, I don't need to make any more thieves tools, I don't think. I don't think I've used any of the uh, lockpicks. Make sure you're close no, why not? Can I talk? Can I talk? I mean, <laughs> yeah. Shh. I mean, yeah. How often do you watch TV, Morgana? You're with me at it's all times. It's just this really pretty lady who does the weather. <laughs> well then. Also, I think she was on the Home Shopping Network, but that might have just been the coat rack. <laughs> <laughs> they were selling a wig. Okay, Do you think I could started. use a wig? Maruki. Do you think I have a chance with the wig? <laughs> you can try, All right. Morgana. Alright, so you kids uh, enjoy your snacks, and also none of you have a chance with a wig, in case any of you are into that thing. So... I know everything about the emotional mind, more than you. Sorry, my eye is real itchy right now. <laughs> that, that, that's See, it. his lip flaps were going when you said that. So. <laughs> uh, my eye's kind of fucked up right now. I don't even know where I am. <laughs> Me. Any ideas? 
We call the phenomenon when believing in a treatment's power is enough to improve your condition. Placebo effect? Yeah, I knew that one. This is it. <laughs> this is it. A nocebo? <laughs> I've never heard that word before, but it's funny. Nice going. Oh, I feel better now that I answered that without the help of the internet. I just use the internet to check my work. <laughs> I need to work on my kindness. I still ha I, it's still the only stat I've yet to increase. Yeah, you're just too much of an asshole right now. <laughs> wow, Ren, you really did. Can I? Can you help me study? Go fuck yourself. I'm sorry, I didn't mean it. <laughs> can you? Can, can, can you share some of your notes? Sure. Mm, oh I yeah. I can't tell sure. if you if you're welcoming or not. Is that like you really want to share notes or? No, I'm happy, happy to, to believe that I'll share them with you and then it'll work. It's a placebo. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. You would have learned that if you paid attention to the doc. <laughs> like me. And then he said, like a placebo, what the fuck? I was just, I just wanted some help, shit. How do you arc to be so explosive? Is that foreshadowing? Is something going to explode in this chapter? I hope so. I'm excited about that. Man thieves going by train. <laughs> this ain't any different from how I get home from school, you know. Oh, we're on the train together for once. That's nice. The train is the fastest way to go. Plus, we can bring pets on here. If no one sees them. Hey, who are you calling a pet? Morgana, would you quit being so fucking sensitive about the fact that you're a cat? To the wider audience, yes, you're a pet. You should be calling me master. But I'm not. Also, Morgana, I'm not calling a cat master on the train. <laughs> That's yes. gonna draw even more attention, frankly. <laughs> Look, I know it's Japan, but still, they have standards. Sorta. You're imagining things. Oh god, it's so mean. I wanna say it. <laughs> This is ridiculous. <laughs> 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 Time to button mash. This game's really funny, you know. Oh, no. <laughs> That's so funny. I hear Did he just hand. hairball on my school books? Now with my dominant hand. I just threw open my mouth. Oh, seriously? The next stop is Shibuya. Shibuya. Doors will open on Shibuya. the left side. Shibuya. 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 Oh, this is our stop. <laughs> Shibuya? Shibuya. Shibuya? <laughs> <laughs> well, see you later. Come I can't on. tell if that was the conductor getting hit by that other train or <laughs> just the conductor. No one else notices that their train just crashed. For a second, I thought that kid was actually heading for the door. It's like, no, it's not. It hasn't opened yet. It just steps out. Oh. Like there are any stations close by to that address. Which side we gotta transfer to? I just followed you guys onto the train. <laughs> what? We gotta walk oh, come on. the way? 
What kind of phantom thief Come on, the train on. and then walks to their destination? Stop your complaining. Yeah, I walk everywhere, right, Ren? It's supposedly a shack. Zips up the bag slowly. <laughs> As expected of a famous artist. Looks like the fastest route is to get to the station square and then go to Central Street. Let's Oops. I cut her off. Alright. Uh, I wasn't paying attention. Like the fastest route is to get to the station square and then go to Central Street. Let's move. Okay. Back to reading signs. Uh, the game text getting in the way of the signs. <laughs> Ryuji was hoping we would have the phantom roller skates, and that's why he, so he could just wheel everywhere we go. That'd be cool. Let's go. But it's only one pair, and because there's three of them, they have to, like, grab onto the guy who's... Okay, there, I see... I see our goal. Oh, running! Wait. Well, that wasn't so bad. You again. Former Olympian. Teacher. Mm, Ryuji with Heelys. <laughs> <laughs> A true adversary. Mm, that may be my strongest opponent yet. Before, he was just slow and possibly made of stuffed cheese. But now. He's mobile. Human mind doesn't change that easily. Let alone. Natural temperament. <sighs> this guy, I wish he sounded like Droopy. Droopy Dog. Huge <laughs> <laughs> Academy. In careful. Perhaps I'll One J Ryuji. One J. And he shakes his fist. <laughs> <laughs> Very slow. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why he has it out for him. <laughs> <laughs> like him and no one else. Specifically, this guy Ryuji with Heelys. <laughs> it's like a tribe called Quest. You say the whole thing. Uh, you ring the bell. Me? Welcome to one of our streams, Twilight Mage. <laughs> no one sneeze or we'll blow this house down, okay? I will now shove pepper up my nose. Who is it? Sensei oh, now rub Morgana across my nose. Um, it's Takamaki. <laughs> I'll be right out. People really do live here. Takamaki. You two are here as well. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Yeah, we're here. Where's the <laughs> fridge? So, sorry, but uh, we ain't here to talk about the modeling thing. There's something we gotta ask you. Is it true Madarame's plagiarizing stuff? He's abusing people too, yeah? Ryuji, you are too upfront about this shit. What's he gonna say? Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> yes, closes the door. <laughs> we read about it online. Ryuji, you're not helping. This? <laughs> Preposterous! Not only is the plagiarism impossible, but abuse. Just realized. Oh god, I can't even see it. Yusuke looks like if Lawrence didn't horribly fuck up his hair. Lawrence from a uh, Fire Emblem. He welcomes Kinda. humans into his own home. It's like Lawrence has a more hateable face violence. structure. It he does. But I guess specifically the hair. Like Lawrence's hair looks like Yusuke's hair if, like, he cut it himself. The one residing here and studying under him. I'm saying it's not true, so it's beyond doubt. You might be lying about it. I it might have happened because it never happened to me. That is utter <laughs> rubbish. He called it rubbish. 
I had no I mean, isn't that how most things work? Well, it didn't happen now. to me, so why is it a problem for the rest of the world? If you continue to ridicule the man I owe my life to, you will rue this day. You really think that? That's right, rue. I've seen iCarly. What's the matter? I heard you yelling. These people are slandering you with baseless rumors. Forgive them, you <laughs> You won't believe they said. They said you're whack, you're ugly, you plagiarize, no one likes you, they hate you, and your family. <laughs> Understood, Sensei. Those Yusuke is like well, subtly I trying know. to like vent toward like myself could be liked by everyone. That's not what we meant. I'm sorry to have butt in on your conversation. However, I do have neighbors around. Won't you please keep it down? Now, if you'll excuse me. <clears throat> what if it just turned out to me. be untrue? I'm sorry. And I have to tell Ray, like, or say, say, like, no, uh, you misunderstood. He was actually way cool. Oh, um, next topic I then. Know. I think you'll be able to believe in Sensei if you saw that painting. It's his maiden work, as well as his most representative piece. It's titled Sayuri. Didn't finish it. <laughs> but it's his most famous artwork. This was the painting. He painted it while she was being swallowed by the fog. <laughs> it was more important than saving her. Quoth the fog. Oh. <laughs> oh, but even I can tell that this is impressive. When I first saw you, I felt the same powerful emotion as when I saw this painting. Me? I wish to present the same you stare of death. <laughs> <laughs> cool. You too know what it's like to be hollow on the inside, don't you? Seriously, consider my offer. I do. Like, you feel like you're a ghost when you could just walk. No, I mean I'm really hungry. Oh, uh, yeah, me too. I hope that we can discuss this further another time. If you'll excuse me, then. Those two seem like nice guys, don't they? Maybe the Matarame we heard about in Mementos is a different person. Man, right when we thought we found a new target. Who also too. just happens to be a painter. How's the MetaNav? Oh. Hey, the app. Was it picking up our conversation? This display. It means that Matarame has a palace too, right? Wait a minute, is that fucking Alvin and the Chipmunks guy on that poster over there? Yes. What the fuck? Oh, I can't Good wait eye. to can't wait to kick his ass. But why? This is for shipwrecked. <laughs> Matarame, plagiarism, and then Shack, huh? These seem to be the keywords. For real though, what the hell's going on? He couldn't he couldn't have lied to us, could he? Does an old man like him <laughs> and Ren's like, palace? if only there was a way for us to find the light. We have the person's name and the location. All that's left is the what that Madarame mistakes the shack for to enter his palace. You mean like how Kamoshida thought the school was his castle? The museum? Or maybe the shack itself? That's right. Let's try saying some things. They can be random guesses. It's a bit sudden though. McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> Password accepted. <laughs> I invented the M, but took credit for it. But it's the, 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 the joke ruined. Can't do it. <laughs> you know, it wasn't going to be McDonald's. It was going to be called Matarames. Hmm. Interesting. And what about <laughs> Museum. Jail. A warehouse. And guidance counseling office. Uh, Might as well add farm. <laughs> no I love for you, you so Doctor's Should office. Uh, another time? The dentist. <laughs> My house. The mailbox. <laughs> Jeopardy. A building Disneyland. Speed Racer. <laughs> Speed Racer the next generation. Well, <laughs> 
Museum. I did it. <laughs> that was his only guess. He's like, uh, I don't know, museum, probably. <laughs> probably the relevant thing. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? Sonic! <laughs> Ryuji, Sonic. we're already, we're already <laughs> moving on. My grandma's basement! Didn't have much of a choice. I think we just happened to get it right. Ooh, this place looks cool. What if I hadn't noticed and then wandered off and got caught by an enemy? Probably would have figured it out once you started walking on two legs. It doesn't work that way for me. So even you can slip into the metaverse without realizing it, Morgana? I don't feel my own legs. Yes. I'm In a numb. Place with minimal cognitive distortion, the differences can be subtle. Ever since you used my fucking head as a turbo controller, like yeah, 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 yeah. Ever since you did that, I have a 10 second delay to my actions. <laughs> that shack is seriously some kind of museum? What? Let's go check it out. Where'd you go? <laughs> Ten seconds later. I'll be right there, guys. <laughs> it's so Joker, you're hurt. <laughs> like they already went home, but he's still in Memento. It's a museum, right? This is Matarame's? Well, a palace is a world formed by a mind twisted by desire. Remember Kamoshida's castle? Madarame's artwork is on display at museums in reality too, though. This exhibit was popular, and people already respect him. Why would he fantasize about a museum? You got a point. It ain't related to plagiarism or abuse either. Let's try looking around. Right what if I could put my bed in good. there? <laughs> right. I want to <laughs> be the exhibit. <laughs> this piece is called me going to bed, and then he crawls. <laughs> <laughs> you can call this a performance piece. Don't film it. <laughs> he says all this in between snores. <laughs> Don't film it. Don't forget to get your Matarame for a performance piece pamphlet. Only two ninety nine for a pamphlet. <laughs> Jesus. We also just opened the cafe, Mick Matarames. <laughs> yes. It's, make sure you look into the kids section so you can get your mappy meal. <laughs> <laughs> the burgers have my face broiled on them. Don't open them up. Just trust me. <laughs> what an incredible talent. This is one of the people watching. <laughs> he's so talking. No? Is he ever going to go to sleep? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, wow. The camera's a uh, beast. Cool. Yep. Yeah, this place looks very different from uh, Tamashita's. I'm happy about that. <laughs> I mean, it would be a pretty boring game if every palace you went to was just Kamoshina's castle, but with a different coat of paint. Yeah. Let's check it out. Dark Gloomy. Dark Gloomy says, Matarame has like Scrooge McDuck, like a Scrooge McDuck coin pool, but it's all frame paintings. <laughs> <laughs> so he jumps into one portrait and he just breaks it and makes a hole through it. Okay. I need to. Re it's been three weeks since I've played this game and even longer since I've been in a castle, so. Hold up. Third eye. There we something. go. Alright, so. I, what was the color that I should be wary of stealing? Is It wasn't yellow, was it? No, if it's yellow, you can take it. If it doesn't shine a color, then uh, you risk uh, alerting people. Okay. Because sometimes it is an item, and other times it's nothing, oh, but yes. sometimes it just spurns uh, an encounter. Got it. <laughs> oh, 
can't be fucking crouch running like that. That. Press the wrong button. I'll take that. <laughs> I'll take that. Persona 5 will bring it back. I'll take that. Persona 5 is back. I jump that way? Nope, too far. Even in the world of imagination, I have my limits. Okay, um... I want to... Oh, I guess I can't. All right. I wanted to pounce on that guy, but I guess I got to keep going up. There's a reason why uh, I believe this part doesn't have any encounters. Oh, um, god damn it. <laughs> Persona 5. <laughs> Persona 5. <laughs> hey. Only on Jedix. Speaking of Jedix, have you seen the Persona 5 anime? Is it like good? The Persona 5 anime is the game, but without any of the good parts. Oh. <laughs> like, it's basically like an adaptation, but it's not as good. It, it, you should watch it if you're either a diehard or, you, like, as a companion piece thing. You're not missing much. Okay. Like, it's not like the Persona 3 movies or the Persona 4 anime, which at least feel like... They have their own styles and like, ooh, that's a neat way to interpret it. Persona 5 animation is literally just like, you're watching a Let's Play, but they cut out all the good parts. I see, okay. Because like, I I've, I watched the Danganronpa anime, and then I watched a playthrough of the game. I thought the anime was much better, because it had pacing. <laughs> Like, I would recommend if you are gonna watch the Persona 5 anime to watch the English dub because, uh, there's a lot of good, uh, lines that the actors got away with. <laughs> now, now I'm interested. Like, Ryuji actually grabs Morgana at one point and he says, YEET! As he throws <laughs> <laughs> That's part of the official That is great. Dub. Like, I recommend watching, like, the little compilations where it's the funny bits. Because other than that, you're basically watching Watered Down Persona 5. Got it. I'll be sure to check out those compilations in three years when I finish this game. <laughs> and they did get the entire uh, voice cast for that, too. Good. I'd hope so. The only other plus I can think of is that uh, Joker gets to talk mm. a little more. Oh, that's good, too. And Xander gets some fun little improv. Hey, hey. I'm trying. Hey, hey. Oh, in the next room, okay. Sorry. <laughs> Morgana, I know your favorite Zelda Let's Play was Twilight Princess, but Hey Hey's not here right now. Hiding, are there? There's no enemies around. Why can I hide? Don't you want to be sneaky? There's nothing to sneak around. Hey, this doesn't make any sense. Madarame is famous for having a variety of art styles, but all the portraits on display here look the same. This is way different from what was at the. Wait a sec. Even in his imagination, he has no fucking talent. You know, the, the one who's uh, talking about Arame? That's actually kind of sad. Hilarious, but sad. <laughs> like, imagine you have dreams, but you're the protagonist, but you can't even visualize yourself doing Why cool stuff. Of him in here? Oh, it's that, it's Minor Douchebag from Mementos. And more important, why is his name written under it? Yeah, it says it right here on his plaque. You're right. Doesn't art usually have, Minor like, J Douchebag. the title of the piece <laughs> or the artist's name? J stands for juice. I, th 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 was, hmm, I don't know why I thought that was funny, but... It, you tried. It was. I don't know. I was thinking juice bag, but <laughs> that didn't quite work. Alright, let's keep looking around for now. Minorly juicy douchebag. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> hey, look! Okay, I guess the full name isn't important. Well, her name is Distorted Painting, I see. Distorted McPainterson. Hmm. Look at this one. Anyway. <laughs> Look at that. Is this... 
Ooh. Damn it! <laughs> there we go. I don't know... What game am I thinking of that makes me want to press the triangle button to steal? Uh... I don't remember. I've been playing some game where you press the top button on the controller. Maybe it was Borderlands? I don't remember. Oh, it's Yusuke. Hey, isn't this a painting the most of that detailed guy? one. It says Yusuke Kitagawa. There's no mistaking it. Huh? Wait a second. What do you think these paintings are? I think you're right. I think they're well painted. I think they're pretty nice. <laughs> yeah, me too. Let's go home. When we went to his place before. This must include well, four more pupils as well. Only Hold one on. remains now. He's. We saw the front door. There, the, the shack was large. There could be other people in there, Ryuji. <laughs> Taking into account what that Nakanohara guy said earlier. Things are getting clearer. I just wanted to go to the fridge and find right. out. Let's keep investigating. We need something to further confirm our deductions. Allow us to deduce. I'll take this. God! Okay. I'm not doing this on purpose, I promise. A brochure. Every time I see the word brochure, I just think of Patrick Warburton's character from B-Movie. Ooh, a chest first. Look, a treasure... Oh! Good thing I have a lockpick. A lunar cutlass. Ooh, that sounds good. Yep, that's a Morgana weapon. I mean, if they say, oh, I should equip this now, it's usually better than what they have now, right? Pretty much. All right. Yep. I don't think there's ever a scenario where they where you find a weapon and they go, "Ooh, this this is a toothpick. Sh should I?" Okay. <laughs> Try touching one of them and see if it takes you to another world like Mario 64. <laughs> and then Karakir adds Joker backwards long jumps into Modern Robbie's treasure. Yahoo! Yahoo! Yeah, 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 yeah! <laughs> I mean, didn't the didn't Kamoshida's palace also have two maps? Yep. Well, I don't know why Ryu Ryu's so dang surprised about it. It's a me, Joker. <laughs> it's a me. Yahoo. Hmm. hmm. Yahoo. Open salami. My PS5 Time to button mash. Very loud right now. <laughs> Time to button mash. Yahoo! 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 I can see it. Make sure I'm not missing anything. I think there was a chest. Was there? Well, there is a something I could steal, and also something I could look at. I mean, on your mini map. Isn't that the chest we just opened? Let me see. Oh, no. Thanks. Yeah, Good yeah. eye. Yeah, I was just like, it would be weird if they were advertising a chest that you already got. <laughs> I didn't realize there was one on each side of the room. What is this thing? Looks... It's kind of creepy. But also interesting. Ah. <sighs> Look at this. Look at this shit. The infinite Spring? A conglomerate work of art that the great director Matarame created with his own funds. 
These individuals must offer their ideas to the director for the rest of their lives. Those who cannot do so have no worth living? This motherfucker killing <laughs> shitty artists? This is most likely about the plagiarism, right? Damn it. What a phony geezer. In other words, his pupils are his property. He doesn't even qualify as an artist if this is true. That's something we should. That, that that's the real worry here. He's stealing the ideas from talented students. I mean, kind of. We're livelihood. gonna ban him from the art community. We're gonna ban him from Square. deviant art. They must all be his pupils through his cognition. Oh no. This even says that they have no worth. Couldn't this be about the abuse? Madarame will keep them around as long as they're useful to him. But the moment they're not. He's treating them like slaves or tools. Why is what a tool. keeping quiet about this? He's got no reason to cover this up. I mean, didn't he say that Madarame raised him? I feel like that would be a that would be at least his reason for covering it up. He did say that he owes Madarame his life for being taken in. Yeah. But still. When we were at the exhibit, I praised one of the pieces on display. But I got taken in by the police. Maybe that piece was <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and that piece was what? What's the call? Ain't this Ryuji, you got arrested. Mami? That's different. <laughs> <laughs> um, it was a performance piece, and I had to pay for it. <laughs> we should confirm these facts with Yusuke first. Yeah. Confirm what, though? It means we should get solid evidence that such crimes actually took place. He could have just made up the crimes in his mind. He could have just painted his criminal activity and then put it in a box. He could just have an imagination so fucked that it makes a palace without him actually doing anything wrong. Besides, there's too much we don't know about Madarame yet. Is that... I wonder if that's possible You're in this right. world. I'll try contacting Kitagawa-kun. Well, Morgana only described it as you have to have to twisted and distorted desires. Yeah. Offer. And if it's just your desires, you could have done nothing and still have a palace. Wait, yeah. you're gonna <laughs> do that? You all better come with me, okay? I'm scared to go alone. A famous, renowned artist, huh? And Yusuke will talk if you're all here. <laughs> well, we'll just prep ourselves until we get confirmation. We'll just hide in Joker's bag with Morgana. This is our first mission. Real <laughs> Ren dragging this Ryuji sized duffel bag into the room. <laughs> no, I, was thinking, I was thinking. Hey, fucking, Yusuke. I was thinking on carrying a duffel bag with both of them in it, just dragging them. <laughs> just my art supplies. It's okay. <laughs> Why are they in the shape of two human people? <sighs> don't question an artist's motives. Yeah, don't question an artist's motives. Meow. <laughs> 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 and also my cat. <laughs> Yahoo. <laughs> <laughs> and my card of Mario. Yeah, if Madarame is abusing people, he's not doing- he doesn't seem to be doing it in, like, the obvious, like, how the fuck does anyone let him get away with this way that Kamashita was. Like, oh yeah, everyone who interacts with me is covered in scabs and bandages. As part of my curse. Hey Jeff, how's it going? <laughs> Oh, 
Neat. All right, let me make a... Mm. Let me, as always, let me... Uh, wait, what? Mm. Not your enthusiasm, but you should stop. Aren't you tired? <sighs> Morgana! <laughs> Morgana! <laughs> Don't I am you love fine! Him? Isn't he great? <laughs> I, I see why you, you have been, like, not as high on Morgana as I've been throughout this playthrough. Is this why? Because <laughs> he's just your dad without being it's... your dad? <laughs> <laughs> no, this is like 25% of the reason why I hate him. You'll see the other 75 later. That's not a small amount. I'm gonna be real. I know. <laughs> I have not been hiding my hatred. <laughs>